What's up folks? Tonight, we're gonna be catching some big fish. Welcome to Three Pound Fishing, coming at ya. Welcome back folks. Tonight, we are gonna put some big fish in the boat and we are gonna have a ball. Folks, this is gonna be a little different episode, I ain't gonna lie. We're gonna go to my buddy's house, gonna have dinner, gonna have a great time there, but at the same time, we're gonna be putting big fish in the boat on the leg. So, we're going to Margaritaville. Yeah, we're gonna have some good times tonight. We're gonna drink some beer, we're gonna have a dinner, we're gonna play with the dogs, but we're also gonna be fishing. So thanks for joining me, please subscribe. Today's gonna have a little bit of an edge. It's after a guide trip, it's late in the day, I don't know, it's 75 degrees, it's warm, the water's warm. 75 degree water, 77 water temperature. So we're gonna be fishing about 10, 12 foot down and about 20 foot of water, catching some crop. It's the end of the day, it's a beautiful day. Just me, nobody else. Let's enjoy ourselves. So all I'm doing is sneaking up to a pile, live scoping, currently have it out to about 25 foot, 30 foot. They're right in front of me. There's not a lot of fish. It's been kind of a difficult day of fishing, to be quite honest with you, um, for post-spawn. Post-spawn's usually, but today it's been kind of tough. A lot of boat traffic, big bass tournament. Those all play a factor in how these fish are reacting especially on the main line. But I see one or two here. We're gonna get a little dip here. See how we do here. There he is. Oh, it was only about. <laughs> I'll tell you what, on the monitor, he looked a lot bigger, but he's about 11. Yeah, he's about 10 and a half. He ain't as big, but I'll tell you right now, but on the monitor, he looked fantastic and there were only two of them. So we have to find a bigger pile, more fish. That's the first fish though. First drop, one fish, bam. That's a good day, that's a good start. Guide trip today went fantastic. Big fish was 15 and a half, caught, I believe it was 40 plus, um, which is kind of, you know, to be honest with you, a slow, kind of a slow day during the post spawn here but we had so many boats it was unbelievable how tough it was so we caught we probably caught over I'm gonna say over 70 80 fish but size wise we weren't keeping anything unless it was a roughly 10 plus at least um, but a good time good group and we had a fantastic time if you're interested in those check it out at 618-694-5162 or three pound fishing at gmail.com Give me a different flavor tonight, folks. We're just gonna have fun. We've got a couple hours of daylight left, clouds, storms all around, it's kind of fun. I love these evenings, I really do love them, especially after the day we had crazy amount of boat traffic. That's a good fish right there. So far, the best fish of the evening. Look at this pig. Oh! Look at that beautiful fish. All I'm doing is fishing piles. This particular fish happened to be about four or five feet. So I was watching it on live scope, pitching it out there, and I'm managing how high or how low it goes into the water column. So I'm trying to keep it for I'm watching the jig go across the fish. And sure enough, this guy was super aggressive. We're gonna let him go tonight though. So it's a good fish. Bam. I don't know if it's as good as the last one, but it's still a fantastic 12 and a half. So today I think we're gonna go, tonight we're gonna go to Reno's house, have a drink, have dinner. That is a beautiful black crappie. Check out the thickness on that bad boy. We're letting them go. Be free, be free. Let other people enjoy you. It just doesn't get any better, folks. It just doesn't. These pontoon ones. 
I'm struggling with all the weights. So I was, uh, what just happened there, just let me walk through that pipe process. So that was definitely not a tick. It definitely was not a thump. It was a kind of a, a slow thud. I think a lot of people on my guide trips, you know, they they feel something and then they, they don't react to it because, well, they don't know what it is. And obviously that's time on the water. There's no doubt there's that's time on the water. But boy, when you feel something, you need, I mean, that bite right there was kind of a half bite, half thump. And so setting the hook immediately, like quickly, is the only way you catch that fish. And I think a lot of people feel that and they let it go and they go, was that a bite? Was that not a bite? That was a bite. That was that was that bite at that time. Right now, they're kind of short striking it, I call it. They're they're not doing the full, you know, some of them aren't doing the full deal, not the full thump. So you get this kind of thuddy feel uh, through your, your pole and your rod. And, um, it's kind of weird to explain. I'm just telling you that if you feel something, it has to happen immediately. It's gotta be a reaction. And sometimes that's the only way you catch those fish. Otherwise they move on, they spit it out, they're off, they're, off. they're gone. So, kind of weird to explain. <laughs> <laughs> kind of weird to explain, but eh, that's what it is. It's just time on the water. I think. fish but still fun he chased it twice little guy it's gonna be a good time thanks for joining me we're gonna do a little fishing after this but we're gonna have some fun too it's a different kind of episode All right, after a long guide trip in the day, a little fishing before we went, came over here to Reno's house, and uh, just have a great time at Margaritaville. It's always great to live on the lake and come visit some folks that uh, we're very close with and just enjoy and relax, kick back, and, and have some fun. So, you know, have a dinner, a couple drinks maybe, and then back on the water for a little evening fish. But a uh, great time relaxing after a full day of guide trips. So just a, just a great time. Now on this evening, we chose to eat at Triple E. It's a great restaurant that's very close to the lake. Currently, they're requiring us to order and they bring it out to your car, which is very nice. But the food's excellent and the price point's great. So if you're visiting the lake, Triple E, check them out. Barbecue, uh, ribs, chicken, you name it, you're, you're just gonna love it. So great evening. We're gonna get back on the water. But we definitely had a great time just hanging out with the dogs and, and Reno and his wife, Jules. Them. Well, they're a little bit more aggressive now. Oh, look at this guy. This guy came out of the roots of that trunk. Unbelievable. Am I going to be able to get this off? There you go. Oh, yeah, good fish. Good fish. Look at this guy. That's going to end it for us today, folks. I appreciate you watching. Good solid 12-incher. 
right there. Fun time on the lake in the evening. Well, I'll tell you what. I know you just been to Reno's. We have a fun time there. I just appreciate you watching. Let them go. Thanks for watching another three pound fishing episode sponsored by these great companies. So if you like this type of content, do me a favor and subscribe. It really does help me out. Share it with your friends. Put it on all the different groups if you would. That would really help me out. And uh, yeah, crappie fishing rocks. This is a great time of the year to fish. It just doesn't get much better.